Okay, so this is an old Western Electric Model 302 telephone that I just picked up. And uh, I believe it was made in 1949. So I can't get it to ring, or I haven't been able to yet anyway. I actually got two phones. I've got this one and a Western Electric 500. And the 500 is a later one. Actually, it's a... I mean, they started making the 500 in, I think, about 1955, but the one I got is a much later one. It was made in 1987, I believe, and it actually does ring. It's not loud, but uh, the thing is, my phone line is a VOIP line. It's not a, a regular POTS line, plain old tele telephone service line. So... They both will uh, work and dial out and receive calls and so on on the line, on the VOIP line, but, uh, but this one won't ring. So I tried uh, rewiring it and it didn't work. And uh, hopefully I'll be able to figure it out at some point. But anyway... I discovered something interesting though and uh, what I'm doing is I am calling oh uh, I'm calling myself basically the the outgoing call is on a VOIP line and the incoming call it's coming back in on another VOIP line it's actually over the same line it's just two different services but uh, I discovered something interesting that's caused by the delay in that. So we are going to uh, call, let me see, I'm going to call myself here. And uh, we'll see how that works. Hello. 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 Anyway, that kind of amused me, so I thought I would share. Thanks for watching.